Welcome back guys, I'm really sorry this game can really drive me to the edge. But luckily now that we have the Manta Rock uh, room we should be able to continue. So equip our torch and let's go. Hmm. Okay, I should have a couple of more minutes left. And oh, I'm actually at the um, the lair of Mantrock, I believe. Yeah, awesome. Hmm. The power of Mantrock is not easily controlled. What makes you think I want to control it? <laughs> Arrogant man. Kill him! Make sure you succeed this time. Haha, <laughs> takes care of that. Okay, well, let's go into the room. And I really lost track of time, so I'm really sorry if this episode is going to be longer than usual, because I, I really don't know it anymore. That editing will really... Um, no, well, never mind, let's just continue. This is really creeping me out. Elia. Good girl. Thank you for, pr for protecting Mentorok's heart. Or essence. So now... Demon Kmmer. Demon Kmmer. So yeah, that's probably where we need to go in the mansion. Because now I know where he hid Mantorok's essence. Hmm, interesting. And he didn't die. This is actually really the first character that didn't die. At and Lindsay. Damn, okay, that was by far the most difficult chapter so far. Damn, oh my god, I really, I just really dislike the traps in that dungeon. Because if you don't see anything, you're pretty much screwed. So, yeah, let's see. Okay, yeah, okay, let's uh, check that book out. Uh, the book shelf. Because the Mentorok Essence should be there and we actually need it to complete the game. So, yeah, might as well look for it. Oh, yeah, that's that's normal. Books flying. More special effects and yeah, books flying. That's uh, that's nothing uh, spectacular. What's this? Oh. Well, what's behind that? The essence of Mantarok. Yes, I c I'll claim it. Is there anything more to be seen? No. Okay. So, what do we need to do now? Because, well... We have everything. I think. Hmm. 
Yes, uh, okay, we have a problem because I don't know where to go now. Uh, dude, stop flying. Flying, we are in a no-fly zone. You're not allowed to fly here. So, you know what? I'll regain my sandy so you can't fly anymore. Stupid bugs. Anyway. Let's see. Um, hmm. I'm kind of wondering where I need to go next. Um... We could we could check upstairs probably yeah why not because I don't think we can do anything downstairs. Um, Atward Lindsay, is there something we did there that could help us? Um, no. Weird. Yeah, I'm really want. the fuck? Well, let's see what's here. The wallpaper in this section of the hallway is oddly merit, as though the wall it sits on it's not even with the rest of the room. Yes, so can I do something there? Mm, doesn't seem that way. What the fuck? What is this? The stained glass depicts a glowing medieval maiden, luminous even with the faint light of the setting sun. The maiden clasps a piece of parchment in her hands. The window gives Alex a strange feeling, almost as if it is magical and not really there. A glowing field of energy protects the window. And now I'm going to remove that area, or remove that symbol, because it doesn't belong there and I want to get rid of it with my dispel magic Mentorok style. BAM! That should do it. Because Mantarok is stronger than all of it. Oh, another page. That's convenient. Heresy! Oh, oh. What is happening? Whoa, 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 he has a circle of power of seven. Damn. He trained. Oh, God. What the hell? It's a jellyfish with legs! Ah! We're screwed. We're screwed. It's a jellyfish with legs. No! I am not your food today. I am your master. Your task is to guard the artifact before you. Let no one touch it. Hmm, that's interesting. Well, I want to touch it. Haha. <laughs> let's do that by starting a new chapter. But before we do that, yes, oh yes, I'm going to save the game because I don't trust myself at all. I don't really like the chapter. So, let's see. Oh, wait. Chapter. Start. In Europe, during the time of the Inquisition, paranoia and corruption ran deep. With the fear of devilry running rampant, the ancients' corruption extended far beyond mortal knowledge, corrupting all that could be corrupted. My researches uncovered an interesting incident. A Franciscan monk named Paul Luther was traveling through the region of Amiens during the witch hunts of the Inquisition. Now, under martial law, the Inquisition prevented anyone from leaving the town and its nearby cathedral. For everyone was suspect. Hmm, interesting. So we're back in Oublier Cathedral. Welcome to Oublier Cathedral. Brother Luther. Called it. I'm glad that our sacred order can bestow hospitality on our Franciscan brethren. I shall not impose, Excellency. I merely request lodging and a viewing of the sacred relic, the Hand of Jude. Many have traveled far and even risked their lives for a glimpse of the hallowed relic's true splendor. Of course, 
it would be wise to keep quiet during your stay. The Inquisition is here for a reason, brother. We seek to purge the deviancy from this town. I am sure that will not be a problem. Amiens appears to be a peaceful hamlet. It appears to be. But deviancy is secreted in the most deceptive places, which I believe is the case with Amiens. Then I wish you luck in your search. The Inquisition does not need luck, Brother Luther. Faith and purity are our guides. Whatever you say, dude. Whatever you say. Hmm. Looks kind of cool right now. Ah, gotta love the lighting. Anyway, let's see what's in here. Oh, door's locked. Well, that's not, uh... Not fun at all. Um, can we go in here? Probably. Um, yes. We, but I don't think we can do anything. Hmm, what's this? Oh, wait. I know where this is. But I don't want to go here. Because I don't think we can do anything there. So, let's go down. Uh, no, well, there's <laughs> one door remaining. So, yeah, let's go in here. Hmm. Oh. Well, it changed quite a bit. For the love of God! God! Help! Come quickly! A murder! A murder most foul! What heresy is this? I... I found him lying here. Dead. I called the guards. Ah. Uh, is this our first suspect? Make sure no one touches the body. Aww. It must be examined for signs of devilry. As for this man, make sure he doesn't leave the cathedral. We will question him later. But... Hold your tongue, Franciscan. Or it might bring my wrath upon thee. Who is to say that you did not commit this murder? If you trust in the Almighty, and you are indeed innocent, then you will have nothing to fear. Poor Luther. Oh well. So, where are we right now? Hmm. Hey, what's this? The painting captures Paul's attention. A small emerald, disguised as part of the painting, glints in the candlelight, as though it has some value beyond being a precious gem. Should Paul try to retrieve the emerald? Yeah, of course! They trapped me, so I'm stealing their stuff. Haha. <laughs> Are you here to pass sentence on me? No. I'm here to free you. You are in incredible danger. This cathedral used to be a place of peace. Now many strange things happen here. I don't want you to end up like the others. What do you mean? The body you found was Brother Andrew, and he was killed to protect a secret. We can't talk about it here. Find me in the bell tower later, and I shall aid thee further. Why are you releasing me? I don't want to see another innocent die like your Franciscan brethren. I have seen Brother Andrew make numerous entries into his journal. This may contain the answers to the cathedral's dark secrets. What can I do? If I were you, I'd run. They will surely hunt me if I run. This has to stop. Then be it on your own head, Luther. Find Brother Andrew's journals if you can. He spent time in the old tower investigating. I believe I can find the key to the old tower in one of my stores. Later, come find me in the bell tower, and I will give it to you. Be swift. We can't evade them forever. Hmm. We need to set things right, but we will be doing that in the next episode, because I'm running low on time. So in the next episode, we're going to continue and find the journal of Brother Andrew. So I hope you enjoy it, 
enjoyed it <laughs> and I'll see you guys in the next one. Goodbye.